Welcome to Cooking with Amanda. Today I'm going to show you how to make these quick dinner rolls. They're French bread rolls that take only about an hour. We want to start with one and a half cups of warm water, put in one tablespoon of white sugar, and you also want to add about one, maybe one and a half teaspoons of salt. Once those are combined, go ahead and add some dry yeast. I used one and a half tablespoons. And see, you just pour it on and on top, let it sit for a few minutes. Usually it only takes about five minutes and then it gets a little bubbly, foamy, just like this. Once you have the yeast and you, should, you can see that it's activated, you know it's healthy, it's alive and ready to help make your bread rise. That's how you know it's time to get to making the bread. So go ahead and add your butter. I should have cubed this. You should be cubing your butter when doing this. Make sure it's nice and cold. Start with about one cup of flour and just slowly mix. You can do this by hand, but it's a lot easier with the actual mixer. Once you've mixed that for a few minutes, add in about two more cups of flour and reserve maybe half a cup to another cup that you'll be adding closer to the end. Stir, 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 as you can see. This is exactly why your butter should have been cubed. You want it cold and cubed before you do this. Luckily, my bread turned out good, even though I didn't cube it. There, we added in our final, about a cup, three quarters of a cup to a cup of flour. It should look like this. When you get to this point, you can take it out. It's real simple, just take it off the hook, move your bowl where you need it. That's what it looks like once you kind of get it kind of mounded, what's the word? Once you kind of, you know, put it together. Put a towel over it, let it rise for about five minutes and it'll look like that. Then I proof it, which means you cover the rolls. You can make them in whatever shape you want. Cover them for about five minutes so they rise a little more. Then brush the tops, you could do an egg wash. I actually did some butter oil. And you pop them in the oven and they should come out looking like this. So let me know if you have any questions.